I was headed to my mom's house to pick up a captain's crate and a few other things that I left there, but I figured, you know what, let me stop at a thrift store. I do need a few things, like I need a shower curtain, which of course I'll buy that brand new, but I need a toilet paper holder also. So I'm gonna just quickly check this thrift store that has a lot of like uh, bath stuff, I guess you could say. And we're gonna check the clothes also, but if I can maybe thrift a toilet paper holder, then I'd rather do that than versus uh, spending like 10, $15 on a brand new one. So let me just see if I can find one. And then I do need to go to like a Bath & Body Works or bath, Bed Bath & Beyond to get a, a shower curtain. So let's pop in this thrift store, see what we can find. So I do have a few new racks. What is this though? The Simpsons little crew neck that's been cut off. It is a uh, 2019 though. Eh, maybe. I think every close is a dollar here, so I'll just put that to the side for now. Let's see if we can find anything else good in here. A lot of women's stuff. A lot of women's. Well, this is a paper towel holder, but I need a toilet paper holder. This isn't bad, though. Well, I think this is the only thing I'm going to leave with was this Polo Ralph Lauren little hoodie. It has the old school tags on it, too. But other than else, nothing good. I didn't find what I was looking for either, so I'm gonna have to go to an actual store and just buy it brand new. All right, so I was gonna intentionally leave this, but hoodies are $2, and let me guys fill you on a thing, right? Let's say a girl comes over. She's like, babe, it's super cold. Can I have one of your hoodies? You go and you pull out one of these, a thrifted $2 hoodie. Obviously, it's gonna be washed. Oh, this has some stains on it. We're gonna leave this one, but I've been collecting hoodies so that way if a girl wants it, she feels special, you give it to her. Little do you know, you paid two dollars for it, so. Like this for example, Forever 21 hoodie, just a plain back hoodie, two dollars. So you know? Well, TJ Maxx definitely has what we need. I'm thinking just like a black one like this, ten bucks. I have a toilet paper holder like this but I don't have so you can put the, oh no see how that rocks that wouldn't be good what about this one yeah seems flimsy oh, let's see what we can find this one this one seems nice all right we're gonna go with this one next we need shower curtains six bucks perfect Today's lunch, we just got Polo Tropical literally down the street from my house. I swear, guys, I said it before with Dunkin' Donuts. My hair looks like a lion right now. Um, but it is so nice for everything to be within a mile reach. But I need to get uh, a scooter, like I said. I don't, I hate looking for parking and moving my car and everything, especially if I'm only going like a mile away. I need to get a scooter so that way I can just pick up my food and, you know, quickly be in and out versus an extra 15 minutes, I guess, because I'm looking for parking, so, yeah. I'm probably gonna combine this footage with yesterday's footage just because I didn't thrift anything yesterday, basically. Uh, we just got that cooler, the Fat Farm hoodie, and the other store, we didn't buy anything. So I'm hoping today will be a better day, uh, but I just realized I forgot my wallet at home, so I'm gonna have to use Apple Pay. I'm hoping Salvation Army uses Apple Pay, um, but they know me well enough that if I need to put my stuff to the side and come back to pay for it, then they can easily do that. But yeah, I forgot my wallet at home today, which kind of sucks because after thrifting, I was planning on going to Fort Lauderdale to get the paint supplies so I should start painting the apartment today. Uh, so we'll see how that works out. I guess I just gotta go to the beach, which I don't know, I really don't want to because it'll be like a 20 minute drive there, 20 minute drive back, like a waste of 40 minutes. So I'm trying to figure it out. Uh, I'm trying to see if I can connect my Apple Pay to my bank account, but I need my debit card number, which I don't have on me, so we'll figure it out. We're pulling up to the first thrift store. Let's hope we find something better than yesterday. Let's get it, guys. All right, so I have a full cart, but I'll be honest, I have no idea what I grabbed. Uh, people kind of just ran to the new stuff, so I kind of just started grabbing. We have this, I don't know if it's a women's or men's, we have this Miami Hurricanes, nice little graphic. Burberries of London, little striped collared shirt. A few different camo jackets. This one's sick. I just love the pockets all throughout. Literally all over. Like another camo, like a duck. Same exact brand though. Uh, let's see. This old school Nautica challenge. 
the Nautica Challenge embroidery all down the bottom. Seems like it might be reversible too. I don't know what this is. Put this one back. And then this one, will, these two we'll put back too because these are just like army jackets. Nothing really too special. Air Force Ones. Super beat, but they're only $7.99. Maybe I'll pick them up. Sadly, super light day. We just had this Nike little embroidered hoodie. This I gotta look up. You could tell it was on an old school Fruit of the Loom, but we have the Giorgio Beverly Hills and this new age Nike center swoosh with swooshes going down each sleeve. If only this was embroidered, but still nice. Well, today's finds of the day. This is gonna be a nice flip. We have this juicer. I'm gonna pay, I think, about $20 for it, maybe $15. It's the Breville Juice Fountain, and these things sell for hundreds plus. So that was a nice little cop. Then we found this really nice Calvin Klein Acid Wash denim jacket. And then as far as other clothes, let's see what we got. We got some Nike Tech Fleece pants, little white pocket. Found this club space shirt, which is gonna be a personal shirt. Found this diamond supply. I'm gonna look it up, I might leave it because diamond supply, I feel like it's kind of dead nowadays. Found this cub shirt, postseason 2018. This was the find of today, helmet laying jeans, besides the juicer, but this is a nice little find, helmet laying jeans. Made in USA, vintage Converse shirt, single stitch. Manning jersey. And then for sneakers, we found some Air Force Ones. Um, these are going to be size, what size are these? Four and a half Y. Then we found another pair of Air Force Ones, like crazy colorway. What size are these? These are gonna be a women's. These are a women's. No, these are three and a half Y. We found these UGG slippers. They're only $2.99 half off though. So uh, I don't know what size these are. These are gonna be size USA 9. Then we found two of these Kappa slip-on shoes. Never seen them before, but I don't know. I might grab them, might not. Don't really know yet. Sadly, they're starting to catch on. Look, Air Force says 10 and a half, $32. Insane. Even if it's half off, it's still not worth it because those things aren't even that clean. Let's go check the normal sneakers, see if we find anything. And of course, nothing. Well, nice little sleeve hit. Sadly, it's 2018. If only it was like 1998. Stranger Things, Halloween Horror Nights. Eh, probably leave it. Thought it was an actual like Halloween Horror Nights all over. So we found a few t-shirts today. We got this Thrasher shirt. Let's see, what is this one? I just love the embroidery of this. I'm probably gonna leave it though, but Montana with all the embroidered flowers, so sick. This is another flower shirt that I thought was really cool. Or not a flower shirt, but like a, the colors on it, which is so nice. But I'm gonna leave that. Where did we find? We found a Call of Duty shirt, Black Ops 4. And then the uh, Halloween Horror Nights. So I randomly just came into a thrift store on the way to running to Target and I forgot my camera at home, but look what I found so far. So we found these Robin jeans. Look at these Ralph Lauren 100% suede pants, size 32, 32, and like a slim fit. Nike SB, Dunk Lowe's, Skate Park of Tampa. Then I just found this polo jacket. Polo jeans coat with the polo spell out. So fire. Just a random stop and I found all of this.